having a big fella who's so capable on his free throw. MP, good. And while any trip that ends with a three-pointer made is a great possession. And we're about a minute and a half into the first quarter. To the middle. And the dunk by MB. He finds a shooter in motion and is confident he can thread him with the lead pass. Well done. Davis in the corner. Good. That's Russell picking up the assist. MP's got 12. Oh, great ball movement there. Pass to MB. The first quarter of action, two minutes in. The nine-foot shot. That's in, and he's now three for three and looking sharp. This is why they feed and beat. His teammates trust his ability to get the job done. A three from MP. And again, it's the Lakers from deep. Yeah, great outside shooting, really fueling this run. Here in the first, just under two and a half minutes played so far. Here's Harden. And the first shot of the night for him, no good. Davis, the pass to Vanderbilt. Great pass to set up the lay-in. I love Davis's ability to read the floor. He's improving his ability to create for others. Harris outside. Now about three minutes gone in the first quarter. Here's Embiid. Davis with some nice D. Those are chances almost always you can rely on him to get you two points. But the is just enough to keep him out of it. And Davis with the basket on the assist by James. He's got 18. Displaying intensity right off the opening tip, especially on the offensive end. They came out swinging, really setting the tone on offense, and the opposition has not been able to respond. Now, here is Reed. Nothing on the board. It's stolen by Davis. Maxi against MP. And again, Los Angeles with the triple. This is as good as it gets for first quarter in terms of shooting the basketball. And the 76ers decide to take their first time out here. You have to like what we're seeing from Davis. He'll just keep hurting them from the three-point land if they let him. Here's a chance for Coach to change that. Some changes for Philadelphia. De'Anthony Melton comes in for Tobias Harris. And it's Patrick Beverly in for James Harden. The Lakers also changing it up. Christian Woods checked in for Vanderbilt. Hachimura comes in for LeBron. And it's Austin Reeves in for Russell. Now here's Beverly. Embiid with a screen on Wood. Read the pass to Embiid. Great tee that time from Davis. And you can see the defenders afraid to kind of get in his way a lot of times when he's on his way to the basket. But on that one, they were there. And it's Davis missing. And so it's Maxi with it. He brings it up for Philadelphia. Down by 15. To the paint, here's Reed, and he uses the glass on the way. And a nice job here early of establishing an inside presence. Pass to Wood. Here's Reeves. And here's MP for three. It's good from long range. Davis has got 24. Defensively, they just look out of sync, not closing out on the threes in time. Embiid against Davis. We've got 13 seconds left to play in the first quarter. Shot clock at five. Embiid finds Beverly. Here's Maxi. Tried to come right back with the three of his own, but it's no good. Domination in the first quarter. It's been pretty lopsided. Los Angeles on top, up by 16. Five from Philadelphia. You're watching 2K Sports. And 
and it's time for more of the NBA Finals on 2K Sports. What a time of year. Let's quickly check out the scoring breakdown here for the Lakers. They've really been dialed in from deep. This is a team that has a ton of confidence in their outside shooting ability. And it seems they've also put an emphasis on moving the ball, working to rotate around the defense and find those quality looks. They've got Muhammad Bamba, Harden out there with Patrick Beverly. Then it's DeAnthony Melton. And it's Vazenkov in at the force line. That's the group for Philadelphia to start the second quarter. Now here's Harden. He has yet to score. Score the basket. Nice shot after missing his first attempt. You don't see a ton of mid-range jumper from Harden, but he's great from distance. Let's check in with our reporter, David Aldridge. Hey, guys. MP in the last time out against Philadelphia played some huge minutes. He scored an incredible number of points and, as always, was a force on defense. Doing whatever he wanted at that end. Numbers like that are sure to get attention around the league. And everyone's excited to see what he does tonight. Guys? Thanks, David. Yeah, it was a special night for him. The team really fed off his energy. Yeah, the catalyst for that win, it, it was an effort that I'm Let's sure he's hoping to replicate tonight. And it's very likely that he and his guys can carry that momentum into this one. And the 76ers call time here. Checked in for the Lakers. And on the screen now is the 2K leaderboard with a rundown of this postseason's assist leaders. LeBron James second. James Harden third. I think these two guys are having a little personal competition here. Officials will go for a different look here. Davis is checked in for Wood. Vanderbilt comes in for Hachimura. Davis has checked in for Austin Reeve. And it's Russell in for Gabe Vincent. Long range from the inbound. Sinks the three-pointer. MP's got 36. And how about the last five made shots have all been threes. The defense is just giving up a barrage. And here's Harden for three. Offensive rebound, three. Last to Embiid, takes a three, can't get it to go, he's made four, and just missed his fourth. It's a plus five advantage for them in rebounding after that one. And for the 76ers, they're shooting about 35% from the floor, not much falling for them. Here is a screen on Russell. Puts up a three, the Lakers with the rebound. Vanderbilt's got four rebounds now tonight. And here's Davis for three. Good, and it's Russell picking up the assist. Three points. Russell's got three assists tonight. You can see the competitive nature for MP right now. He's locked in and looking to add his scoring totals on every trip down. Popped up there for MB. And they double up MB. Read the pass to Maxi. And Davis sends it back. A big block from the big fella, Anthony Davis, putting every inch of that seven foot eight wingspan to work there. Trains it from beyond the arc. 12 straight points off of three pointers, and the D looks shell shocked. Guys, they're looking for a way to score here. Yeah, they've had a tough time taking the lid off. Embiid with it, picked up by Davis. Embiid kicks to Reed. Shot clock at six. Harden the pass to Embiid. No good again that time. Not his best efficiency this quarter. And look, sometimes that's how it goes. Embiid's shot is good. And really, as the three-pointers keep dropping, you get the sense that the frustration is mounting for the defense. Reed dishes to Embiid. Philadelphia moving the ball around. Harris against James. Harris passes to Embiid. Doesn't go for him. Great tee that time from Davis. MP outside. From outside the arc. Oh, 
but he nails it just in time. One eye on the rim, one on the clock. What a play. Boy, that was close. Got it in just in the nick of time. And so it's the Los Angeles Lakers sitting on a lead of 40 points at the end of the quarter. Terrific play. Defensively, they have gotten after it, contesting every shot going up. Back right after this. Thanks for joining us for postseason basketball. Clearly, guys, the second half is going to be a tough task for the Philadelphia 76ers. You see him trying to lean on that three-point shot? That can be a blessing or a curse. Right now, they're cursed. <laughs> it seems like a, a good time to focus their efforts elsewhere. seeing how things are shaking down for the Lakers. They have all the momentum right now with the lead in the series and the lead in this game here at the half. Playing like a runaway truck like the Diesel. Um, um, um. They got all. And that's all for us. Now it's time to send it back to Kevin Harlan for the beginning of. We're back with you, all set to bring you more action from Game 3. You look at MP in this one, he's been everywhere. Man, he's been running wild on them through that first half. Absolute dynamite on offense. If they don't change their approach in the second half, eh, let's just say his success will continue. So the Lakers 5 right now. The two Lakers stars on the floor. LeBron at the 3 and Davis at the 5. MP out there with Russell. And it's Vanderbilt in at the four-man position. Maxi kicks to Harris. I got him, I got him. Over LeBron. Harris's shot is off. And they've got a big lead, not just on the scoreboard, but really in the rebounding numbers as well. Connects again. That gives him 51. Making it look easy. No doubt about the consistency when it comes to scoring the basketball for him tonight. A real nice lift for their offense. Russell against Harden. The pass to Embiid. Releases and another make to his scoring column. His fifth basket of the game. Now shooting five of eleven. Unfazed by that defensive pressure, Embiid uses his excellent touch on that jumper. And here's Davis for three. It's hauled in by Harris. Not quite enough defense that time around. Just lucky he was off. Timeout called the 76ers. The 76ers making a switch here. Amba's checked in. Duke, 76ers shooting only 31%. Their offense really struggling to put possessions together. Harden the pass to Reed. Back to Harden. Pass to Maxi. And slam dunk by Maxi. He's a small guy with big hops. Maxi goes up high for that finish. Here's the three. That's good. From Davis on the assist by James. James has got his eighth assist here tonight. And he got loose from the three-point range in the first half and showing signs here that he's still got the flow in the second. Maxi against MP. Maxi kicks to Bamba. 
Here's Harden. Played in with a nice touch off the glass. They are just killing them on the interior. For Los Angeles, they've gone two of four here to start the second half. And here's MP for three. The rebound by Harden. The 76ers have gone three of four so far in the third quarter from the field. Pretty good start to the hand. That one goes. Count it. Maxie's got his second bucket. A physical scoring guard. Maxi is at home on the inside. On the wing, MP. And good! He hits it again. And he's been dominant here thus far. Shouldering the offense, GA really taking it to the opposition. Two minutes remaining in the third. Maxi against Davis. Here's Harden. And Davis pulls it down. Davis has got rebound number seven for him tonight. Another one goes. Incredible. 60 points. This guy cannot be stopped. They've had no answer for him in this one. Harden the pass to Harris. Back to Harden. Two left to play in the third. And the dunk by Bump. Full display there. Bamba swooping in with authority. The three from Davis. Second chance shot, and Davis puts it in. Davis has got his first two points of the night. Uh, unwilling to let up, even for a moment. That's his killer instinct, just fanning the flame. Always plays hard until the final whistle, no matter what the situation is. And it's Davis with the ball for the Los Angeles Lakers. Got that one up quick. 62 points for Davis. Keep riding that hot hand. He's been pretty much unstoppable. Passes it to Bamba. Maxi with it. And it hung on the rim, but wouldn't fall for him. And here's MP for three. Offensive rebound. Vanderbilt can't cash in from close range. 76ers have gone 5 of 9 on field goal attempts since halftime. 
and the basket by Harden. And that's 10 straight points in the paint. The defense, nowhere to be found. Lakers have gotten six of their 12 shots to drop for him here in the second half so far. James, the pass to MP. Connects again from distance. He has been on the money from deep. Yep, definitely looking to shoot it as much as possible. The 76ers shooting a stellar 60% since the halftime break. Harden kicks to Reed. Pass to Maxi. Harden outside. Reed a screen. Let's the three fly. Drills the three pointer. Harden's got seven points here in this quarter. This is what great shooters do. Harden is rising to the three point challenge. And at the end of the third quarter, a huge lead in this one may already have been decided. Los Angeles on top, running away with it. Five from Philadelphia. And there have been two very different. making some changes here and now we'll get a perspective here on the hustle game how it's been going for Los Angeles they have found a lot of success in transition running at every opportunity and getting points before the defense can get set and just a great job converting those second chance points as well they're having a great night getting those second and third shot opportunities Tobias Harris is out there with Reed then it's Harden and there's Mohamed Bamba. And it's Maxi in at the shooting guard position. That's the group on the floor for Philadelphia. Here's Harris. A second chance effort. Hachimura grabs the miss. Los Angeles has gone one of three from outside the arc since we've reached the fourth quarter. Fires from deep. And another one falls. 71 points and no end in sight. Young fella is in the zone. The defense right now looks helpless. Prince against Harris. And contact on the shot, so he'll be shooting free throws here. He was not going to settle on that play. Harris works his way inside and does a good job of drawing the foul. And so he hits both. Well, if you're just tuning in, welcome. We've got about three and a half minutes gone here in the fourth quarter. And here's Davis for three. And another three for the Lakers. And perimeter scoring, I have to imagine it was a topic of discussion at halftime. And you see this so much more nowadays in the NBA. Teams putting a larger emphasis on jacking up threes. Austin Reed. That's his first personal foul. The first free throw is good. Let me say this. If you need it, he's got it. Harden does everything you want out of an offensive weapon. Good on both. And a little over three and a half minutes in the books so far here in the fourth. And game three of the NBA Championship Series is all but in the books. Congrats are in order to... Night on an outstanding effort and a well-deserved victory for the Lakers. And this was one that never really was in doubt, I thought, an all-around dominant performance. And you kind of thought that maybe even going into the game. Yeah, there was a sense of that in men. They, they just pretty much blew them right out of the water. A clinic was put on display here today. And this is going to put them on the brink of a sweep in a championship. Just one more win. 
And that trophy will be theirs. And I think they'll get it in game four. They are on an unbelievable roll right now. And I just don't see anything slowing this group down. If the momentum was going to change in this series, I think it was going to have to happen tonight. Instead, they put the hammer down and already have one hand on the trophy. And you know, looking back at all the contributions tonight, it was a really phenomenal all-around game for Davis. He did a great job following his team's game plan and not rushing anything on offense, which allowed him to catch fire. Love to see him inside passing like this, as well as guys being on the same page. And here's Davis for three. Harden grabs the miss. And so it's the Lakers taking care of business here. You have to think at this point, up three zip. It's only a matter of time now, Greg, until this series is in the books. Well, you know, this victory all but seals the deal. As strong as they look throughout this game and this series, I'll be shocked if they don't close it out in game four. Well, that'll do it. Thanks for joining. Right, Sam time to pay the piper oh is that you no it's justice what MP is on the verge of becoming the first rookie in history to be rookie of the year MVP a champion and finals MVP are you ready to call him the goat yet or what if he pulls this off it'll be the most impressive start to a career we've ever seen but like I said since day one he's got to do it over a long period of time to be the goat but he'd be well on his way yes that's right I wasn't expecting you to be so reasonable about this. Hey, I'm not a clickbait merchant. This guy's amazing. What can I say? I, I, I'm not sure I'd respond to that. I think wow. I like it better when we fight. <laughs> Maybe we'll talk about celery and tuna fish. I know you got some strong opinions about that. Yeah, yeah, that's gross. Disgusting. Anyone who likes it should be thrown in jail. Well, lock me up and throw away the key. <laughs> oh, and we're back. You gotta have a little crunch in there. Then it's just no. fish. That's how you leave it all out on the floor. Nice job. You look out there and see. What's good, MP? Time to do what you do. It's game four of the NBA Finals. The Lakers have simply been on a rampage, storming through the finals, and with a commanding 3-0 lead, they now have a chance to do what very few teams have even dreamed of. Can they sweep their way to the Larry O'Brien Trophy in a game four against the Philadelphia 76ers? This is the NBA Playoffs, and it's up next. It's been a very one-sided NBA Finals. It's three games to nothing. Could we be crowning a champion tonight? And tonight, we've got the Philadelphia 76ers playing against the Los Angeles Lakers. I'm Brian Anderson. With us tonight, two great basketball minds, Grant Hill and Steve Smith. Also, our reporter, Ali LaForce. So let's take a look at the Los Angeles Lakers starting lineup. Vanderbilt at power forward with Davis in the middle. D'Angelo Russell is out there with Davis. 
And it's James in at the three. Small forward. And for Philadelphia, we've got Maxi. Paul Reed is out there with Joel Embiid. Then it's James Harden. And it's Harris in at the three. You look at the Lakers in position to close it out tonight. Sweep the series and celebrate. But these home fans are hoping it won't be tonight. If nothing else, get one win, extend the series, and send it back on the road. The three ball. And Davis with the basket. All the assist by Davis. And that's just good positioning by MP on the play. He's right where he wants to be to take that quick shot. Out to Harris. Back to Harden. Rebound collected by Anthony Davis. And here's Davis. He'll bring it up for the Lakers. It's a three-point game. MP no good. Here's Philadelphia. Outside Maxi. Pass to MB. Harden against Davis. And it's blocked by Davis. Using that seven foot six wingspan, Anthony Davis, an elite shot blocker. Oh, another miss by MP. He didn't make them pay for that weak defense, but they just can't rely on him to miss those kind of shots. That's a nice read. The value of keeping your eyes up. Los Angeles has gone one for three from beyond the arc. And here's MP from outside. And so far in this one, two for four. Can't let MP get comfortable firing from outside the arc. That's a recipe for disaster. Maxi surveys. And that one makes him two for two. He's in his rhythm. Just taking it right to the rim. And no one was there to greet him. Wow, that's a defensive breakdown. Can't do that against good scores. Counted from distance. Scoring well this quarter. Picking up steam as he goes. The 76ers have gone two for five here in the first. Pass to Embiid. Yes, and a nice assist from Harden. I love the confidence Embiid plays with, especially this close to the rim. Outside Davis. There's the triple. And the Lakers hit again from deep. His shot making has been superb this quarter. He's taken over this game. Russell against Harden. Embiid a screen on Russell. Three-pointer, Harden. Rebounded by LeBron. He's kind of lost his way this period, having a hard time getting anything to go down. They get it again. Outside for Russell. The three nails it from beyond the arc. When you let a team knock down that many threes, you know you're likely to be on the wrong side of a run. Harden against Russell. Harden, the pass to Reed. Outside Maxi. From outside the arc. Oh, and he can't make that one. Two for three now, his first miss. And here's MP from outside. And another three for the Lakers. And he's carried them this quarter. A dominant offensive stretch. Philadelphia has gone 0 for 2 from outside. Pass to MB. Shoots over Davis. Oh, no good again that time. And here's Davis. He'll bring it up for the Lakers. And MP gets it to go. On the assist by Davis. Davis has got 18 points in the game. And Philadelphia calls time here. Let's keep it up.
changes here for the 76ers. Melton, he's checked in for Tobias Harris. And it's Beverly in for Harden. The Lakers making a switch here. Stolen by Davis. The three is up. That one's good. Seven for ten now. Man, they're having a hard time defending the triple. That's three in a row. Here's Maxi. Up top, Embiid. To stop the run, Wood grabs the board. The Lakers have gone a fantastic 8 of 11 so far. Let's it go from deep. Offensive board, Davis. Soft touch off the glass. <laughs> An outstanding first quarter from the field. The 76ers shooting an unremarkable 30% in the first. Maxi with a screen on Achimura. Melton passes to Reed. Up top, Beverly. Now here's Embiid. Down to five on the shot clock. Puts it up. The shot misses. Easy chance from mid-range. Wouldn't be surprised to see them run that play again. Gets the three ball to go. MP's got 24. And early on, they've been on a tear. Just getting whatever they want offensively. They established the pace. They made shots. This is why they're way out in front. And both teams running long-range plays that are working. How often do we see this these days? Clubs answering each other from range. And so it's the Los Angeles Lakers. They have a confident 20-point lead right now. The hustle they... And we welcome you back. Making some changes here. And we're now a little over two and a half minutes into the second. The shot by Russell, no good. Philadelphia has gone one for three from downtown here in the second. And so in the game for the Lakers, LeBron and Vanderbilt are the three and four. MP is out there with D'Angelo Russell. And it's Davis in at the five, down low. Pass to MB. Outside Maxi. Beyond the arc. The Lakers with a rebound. Davis has got five rebounds tonight. It's stolen by Maxi. No good. Good D by Vanderbilt. That's going up against a defense that knows your tendencies. Thanks, guys. Well, MP in their last time out against the 76ers put on a show. He ended up with a jaw-dropping amount of points, and he made the defense look helpless as he piled on the points. A legendary performance that will be talked about for years to come, unless he's able to do it again tonight. Brian? Great report there, Allie. It was obvious he could do anything he wanted. A fantastic win. Well, I'll tell you. He was enjoying himself out there, kind of like us here in the broadcast booth. And whoever was matched up against him wasn't enjoying themselves. What I like is they just kept calling his number. Sometimes we see coaches go away from what's working, and we wonder why. And all quarter long, it's been the same story, inconsistent with this offense. Here's Davis. Oh, nice fake, but the layup's off the mark. And here's Harden. He'll bring it up for Philadelphia. Pass to Harris. Maxi against James. Maxi passes to Embiid. Here's Harden. And he's going for the lob! And remember, James Harden is usually a front runner in the league in assists. He has great vision. The Lakers dominating the game. Earlier, they held a 23-point lead. MP, that one's good. Wow, five consecutive threes. This defense looking very frustrated right now. Harden against Russell. Harden, the pass to Reed. Here's Embiid. Lays it up and banks it in. Embiid's got his second basket on the night. They just look so overwhelmed inside. Yeah, that's why they continue to get attacked. Davis from long range. That shot's good. Russell making the play. Russell's got assist number five here tonight. 
Harden fires away from outside. He got it up in time, but it would not fall for him. MP getting it done for Los Angeles. He's nearing the 40-point mark, just getting whatever shot he wants. Back after this. And we thank you for joining this postseason broadcast, and it's been an outstanding first half for the Los Angeles Lakers. Defending these guys does not look fun. You just have to extend so far out to contest shots, and then they go ahead and make them anyway? Which then forces you to try to match their three-point output. Not a comfortable position to be in. Seeing how things are shaking down for the Lakers. They have all the momentum right now with the lead in the series and the lead in this game here at the half. Playing like a runaway truck like the Diesel. Uh, uh, uh. They got all the momentum. A team on a mission right now. Starting to see that finish. And that is going to do it for us. Let's get back to some second half action with Brian Anderson and company. arena welcome back to the nba finals on 2k sports hey you look at mp in this game he's been everywhere and the bulk of his production has been generated along the perimeter he's been vital to spacing the floor for them makes everything else you want to do easier to accomplish joel Embiid is out there with paul reed then there's tobias harris then there's tyrese maxi position that's the group on the floor for Philadelphia 12 straight points off threes this defense is not extending very well pass to Embiid Davis with the defensive effort and you have to think that they're leading this game because of how they've controlled the boards tonight and Davis gets it to go on the assist by Davis Davis has got 42 in the game. Harden against Russell. Now here's Harden. He's closely guarded. Pass to Embiid. On the wing, Harden. Just five to shoot. Up and over Russell. Harden with a bucket. Harden's got five points. 
Yeah, just a smart call by Harden. Using the pick to shake off the defense and get himself a look. Davis against Maxi. Connects again from distance. Ooh, you can tell he's feeling it right now. The B.A., he's on fire. For Philadelphia, they've gone just one of three in the second half. Embiid is screen on Russell. Harris outside. And he'll draw the foul. He'll head to the line for two. It's on LeBron James. And the defender there a little out of position. Harris sees this, takes advantage, draws the foul. Tobias Harris. Two shots. First free throw is good. Slowly but surely, Harris continues to elevate his game. The shooting, the playmaking, the ability to make a difference. And Harris drops them both. And James has got the ball here for the Los Angeles Lakers. From deep, MP. Good! Another from three. Man, he's really launching him from outside the arc. Man, so locked in. Feeling confident in his three-point shot tonight. Harden, the pass to Harris. Yes! And a nice assist from Harden. Harden's got his fourth assist in this one. Yeah, and a triple from Harris matching the one on the other end. Just, just great back and forth. A nice shot by MP. We've been watching him hold court out of the arc. Just an unforgettable performance tonight. Harden against Russell. Harden, the pass to Reed. Outside Harden. Yep, count it. Harden's got seven points. Looks like we're starting to see a pattern here. Not afraid to get in the paint and get wet. Pass to MP. Here's the three. And the Lakers hit again from deep. Here in the second half, they're really focused on stretching the floor. This was obviously a focal point coming out of the break. It looks smart when the shots are going down. Here's Russell. Can't hit that one. Harden with the defensive effort. Philadelphia has gone one of two shooting from the perimeter since halftime. Maxi against James. Pass to Embiid. And then Embiid with the dunk. Yeah, Embiid can throw it down from anywhere. So much power for the big fella. Outside Vanderbilt. From deep, MP. Again! What an avalanche! And he's been dominant so far in this one. Shouldering the offense. Really taking it to the opposition. 107 left in the third. Harden, the pass to Reed. Embiid inside. Checked by Davis. And out of bounds, Los Angeles will have it. Melton, he's checked in for the Sixers. Lakers making a change here. Davis has checked in. And let's quickly check out the scoring breakdown here for the Lakers. Smart ball handling from them in this one. Passing around to get ahead of the defense and putting it in the hands of ready shooters. Yeah, something else they're doing in this game is striking from long range. The defense just hasn't been able to keep them off the arc tonight. The Lakers have gone one of four since the fourth quarter began. And the Lakers, looking at who they've got, Rui Hachimura is out there with Christian Wood. Then it's Austin Reeves. Then there's Torian Prince. And it's MP in at the one. A few possessions into the fourth. Just over a minute play. Gets the three to fall. Ooh, heat check after heat check. He rises to the occasion, trying to wheel his team to victory. Prince against Melton. 
Who poked away? Beverly outside. Six to shoot. Late clock. The Sixers need to put one up here. And the basket by Embiid. Without missing a beat, Embiid gets the shot up. And that's the work of an assertive offensive player. There's Davis with the three. Nails it from three. MP's got six points in the quarter. <laughs> Just incredible. I mean, he's really making it rain out there, knocking them down one after another. Yeah, the defense has allowed him to get into a rhythm from there, and he's been relentless. Drains the triple. And both teams running long-range plays that are working. How often do we see this these days? Clubs answering each other from range. Oh, wasted no time on that one. Adding to this lead, he's been dependable and consistent at the offensive end. Pass to Vizinkov. Drives to the hoop. And there's the slam dunk to finish it off. Every organization needs team first guys like Patrick Beverly. That's a terrific pass. Now MP. And that one's good. Zinko. An aggressive move to a strong finish. He is just unwilling to settle. He gets right to the rim and makes sure they come away with points. A nice shot by MP. They're really employing a deep-range initiative here in the fourth, and it's working. Interesting approach coming down the stretch, looking to rack up points in chunks. Melton with the ball. Guarded now by Wood. Beverly for three. The Lakers with a rebound. Wood's got six rebounds now in the game. MP looking around. Shot from 12. And another one. 71 points and no end in sight. He's in the zone. The defense looks helpless. That's going to do it for this game. These teams, the entire season, what an unbelievable journey. It'll be a hoisting of the Larry O'Brien for the Lakers. Pretty clear who the better team was today. They dominated in just about every phase of this game, Grant. <laughs> B.A., it's almost hard to think what didn't go well for them. Their plan, their execution, everything was absolutely on point. And what a dominant showing here in these finals. They are going to coast to a title with a clean sweep. You could tell how badly they wanted to win this trophy as soon as the series got underway. And it's a testament to their work ethic and passion for the game. They wanted this championship bad, and they went out there and left no doubt in anyone's mind that they were the better team that deserved to win this series. And even the opposing fans can't deny this was a sensational game for MP. The scoring effort from him, unreal. Carrying this team, I mean, he was amazing tonight. Basket counts. And the team counts on Embiid for this, to grab loose balls and send them right back. Davis from long range. No luck on that one. And so here is Philadelphia. Seven second difference between the shot clock and the game clock. Beverly, the pass to Melton. They set a pick. He shoots. And the 76ers tack on two more. <laughs> One positive takeaway, at least they're finally showing signs of life out there. They put together some great possessions here at the end. It's a shame they could have used this run much earlier. Yeah, they blocked out the noise, blocked out the distractions, kept on grinding, and this is their reward. Hey. And there it is! The Los Angeles Lakers have won it all! Thank you for coming out and cheering on your team. They go on the road and take care of business, and now the championship is theirs. To be on the road, to silence the crowd, winning the championship with all of it on the line, what an incredible performance. Hats off to this team. An incredible moment. You can see it in their faces. Forever known as NBA champions. And you can bet back home the celebration has started. Time now to send it to Adam Silver, the commissioner of the NBA, for the trophy presentation. 
Time now for the trophy ceremony. NBA Commissioner Adam Silver ready to present the Larry O'Brien Trophy to the champions. Kendra, we'll start with you. Thank you. MP, congratulations on the championship. Thanks, thanks, Kendra. Can you talk about having your father join you for the press conference? Was that his idea or yours? His, for sure. There was no way I was gonna <laughs> let him sit up here and take credit all by himself. Do you have any idea how many times I shag balls for this kid at 2 a.m.? <laughs> that's true, that's true. But it's only because he felt guilty he didn't work nearly as hard when he was in the uh, league. I wanna tell you about them false narratives. Come on, now. <laughs> no, no, he knows I'm just playing. Oh, man. Uh, look, uh, to be serious, though, it was my idea. Um, I wouldn't be here without my family. They're everything to me, not just my dad, but my grandpa. Y'all you know, know him as Truck, but to me, he's always just been grandpa. You know what I'm saying? And uh, he was around so much that he honestly was like a second father to me. And, um, you know, he was always supporting, always teaching. I just wish he was here to see this. Anyway, uh, next question. Uh, please, you, 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 in the back, in the back. 有人说您是继已故科比布莱恩克之后在中国最受欢迎的NBA运动员。您对这件事有什么感想? There are some who say that you're the most popular NBA athlete in China since the late Kobe Bryant. How do you feel about that? Uh, wow. <laughs> Listen, I'm not going to get into who's the most popular, but anytime you're mentioned in the same breath as someone like Kobe, that's a huge honor. You know, he was my hero growing up. Uh, excuse me? <laughs> after, after my dad, <laughs> calm down, Pop. Okay, <laughs> obviously. Um, most kids, you know, worship LeBron, and he is a GOAT for sure, but I always loved Kobe's game. Aesthetically, it was just beautiful basketball, you know? And his approach to winning is something I try to emulate as much as I can. Um, I've got a lot to accomplish before I reach that same level, but to be mentioned with him, that means everything to me. And if people in China love me like they loved Kobe, that's incredible. Because Chinese fans, they know ball. Xie xie. Thank you. Hope I said that right. Thank y'all. All right, on that note, good night. Good night. Good night. Thank y'all. Thank y'all. Yo. Thank y'all.